Hi, I'm Phil Williamson. In this second video, what we'll go through is the output management of IntelliDocs and show how it's a rich platform for customer communication. As described in an earlier video, IntelliDocs Infinity is an engine that allows you to define a series of business rules and using data and content, be able to put that information and push it out into pretty much any format you want. So if you want to generate a smart document such as a, a contract, quote, proposal, statement, invoice, we can put that kind of information together and generate that as an output document. What we're finding more and more, however, is that pushing information to a printer is a diminishing or reducing business. What we're finding more and more is people want to push information out electronically. So your customers will choose to have something sent to them electronically instead of printed. And what they're looking for is much more richness in the output type. So with IntelliLox Infinity Engine, as described before, we can extract da data out of pretty much any system. So any database, uh, any ERP system such as an SAP, uh, any CRM application such as Salesforce, and we can use that data for generating output. But there are a couple of extra components that IntelliDocs have that makes it interesting. The first part is workflow. Now what IntelliDocs workflow allows you to do is it allows you to generate an output, but then be able to push that document or that output to various people. For example, if I'm putting a, a, a quote together and my, my manager needs to approve that document, it will automatically route that document to my manager. Uh, we can then get things such as an approval or a rejection or uh, an understanding around that. So you can pretty much have any process around a document, a document process and you can put that together. The second part is what we call actions. Okay, what an action is, is you can basically define uh, an output event. For example, if I, in my CRM, choose that my customer will receive something electronically instead of printed, Dynamically, IntelliDocs can use that data and can push something out in an electronic format instead of a printed format. So I can define a, an action that says push it out electronically. But actions are much richer than that. You can basically define any kind of interaction you want. So I can push something out electronically and then I might send a, uh, an SMS. So I can choose to have as an SMS, as an output, that might notify my customer that they've automatically received their statement or their invoice. I can also say, all right, I want to send a copy up into my document management system, as well as also push something out to a printer for, for archiving. So I can pretty much define any action that I like. Now these actions are a, a, a foundation component within IntelliDocs. They're also an extendable, an extensible component that you can actually start building your own. So if you want to start pushing something out to any kind of application. So suddenly we want to write something into SharePoint or we want to write something into Microsoft CRM. We can define an action that allows you to push that information out. Combining workflow and actions gives us a rich sophistication with which how we can manage and manipulate a document-based process.